have to be a doctor to know that there are lots of differences between men and women, especially when it comes to our heart health. Tonight, Linda So shows us why heart disease tends to be overlooked in women and why men are more likely to have problems when they're younger. Hello. Hi, Betty. Hi, Hi Doctor. So how are you? you? How Always. Are you feeling? How are you good. feeling? I'm good. Betty Blaze doesn't mess around when it comes to her heart. I actually felt as if I were having a heart attack. It was just like this pressure on my chest, shortness of breath, and just not able to get around. Betty had clogged arteries and ended up having two triple bypasses, but getting the right diagnosis took a while. Doctors told her she was having anxiety attacks. I heard anxiety attack so many times I just wanted to scream. She finally got the right answer when she saw Dr. Gerald Insel, chief cardiologist at Good Samaritan Hospital. He says what happened to Betty is common. Many women with heart disease aren't getting diagnosed early enough. Women have much more atypical symptoms. Fatigue, I feel tired, I feel weak, I just don't feel right. Shocked me. I was in total shell shock because my weight wasn't that heavy and uh, I had been uh, exercising for quite a bit. Bailey St. Clair had a heart attack 10 years ago, but didn't even know it because he didn't have any symptoms. I never had any uh, pain down the arms. I never had anything in the neck, and I never had any profuse sweating. But doctors diagnosed him right away with several routine tests. The problem is those same tests aren't always accurate on women. So for example, if you do the routine EKG, if you take a man and you take a man sitting, standing, lying, hang me on the ceiling, you'll have the same exact EKG. But women, they have much more variability in terms of their EKG. So number one, the EKG is much less accurate. And contrary to what many people think, women are just as likely to have heart disease as men. In general, you know, men, we tend to think of men as having a higher risk for coronary artery disease. And it certainly is true when a man is in their 30s and 40s. But as we age, especially past the menopause, women are actually at a higher risk than men. Despite the differences, there is one thing both men and women can do to prevent heart disease. Stick with a good diet and exercise. I stay very active. Um, I get my rest. I know when to quit. Beautiful, 118 over 80, fantastic, Betty, great job, fantastic, that's great. In Northeast Baltimore, Linda So, ABC2 News. If you'd like to learn more about heart health and MedStar Physician Partners, you can call 1-877-MPPDOCS.